So we're talking about forces and what are the effects that forces can have on objects as the uh, diagram kind of gives away the first one which is that forces can compress uh, objects such as this stress ball compress objects and uh, very often uh, we'll go on to looking at how a spring can be compressed and store energy in the form of elastic strain energy so that's compression the second thing that forces can do is to accelerate to accelerate bodies and this is important vocabulary so when you're describing motion don't just say it moves or it's it goes along actually describe it in physics terminology and here we have to say if your force acts on a body if a resultant force is on a body then it will accelerate so it'll get faster and the third thing is that a, a body when acted on by a force may change direction may change direction now actually what's happening in the situation where you have a planet orbiting or a moon orbiting a planet is that the uh, what what's actually happening is that we are ac accelerating we are accelerating the the moon towards the planet but it's it's going quite fast so it, it's actually falling all the way into the planet but as soon as it falls down a little bit it moves away so this is kind of the same thing as accelerating they are related but uh, we'll think of them as three different things that forces can do they can compress they can accelerate objects and they can change the direction of objects such as an orbiting moon